Doctor, we're at this point again. Masks coming off in lots of places, too soon for some, not soon enough for others. Are they following the science, or is this about politics? Shep, I think that the states are going to tell you they're following the science, especially the ones I know, that have delayed. I know, but I want to know the truth from you, the to expert. The <laughs> so, so the truth the truth is that they're all doing it with arbitrary standards that have not been transparent. So they're following the science if they consistently see these decreases. I think pushing it out to March is the smart thing to do. New Jersey and some other states have done that. But that depends a lot on the behavior in between there, because as we've known before, these decreases can slow down if we start to see some of these behaviors coming back, super spreader events, large indoor gatherings with a lot of unvaccinated people. So the science would tell us the entire state, uh, the entire country is lit up red with high transmission. You just talked about the deaths. We had 16,000 deaths in the last seven days. And most hospitals around the country are at 85 to 95 percent capacity. Not all COVID patients, Chef, right, but right, right, right. we're still trying to just keep up with everything that is coming in. So I think you're asking the right question. And here's what nobody seems to talk about. What are the metrics we're going to use to put things back in place? Because we've been duped before in May when the CDC said you're vaccinated, no masks. And we all felt cheated. We got our vaccines. and You then know what, Dr. Patel? Masks. Good luck getting this nation to put masks back on. If neighbors and dogs aren't dropping or on the sidewalks, it ain't happening. You know why? Because we hear it from everywhere. I agree. Do not get me wrong. And you know what I, that's I about? And I wear so many people who are experts like yourself will say that's not just about people being fed up. It's about the mixed messages. When the leaders can't all speak from one voice and they have it. Right from jump. What do they expect right. people to think? They expect to think none of them know what they're talking about. Shep, I agree. I, and by the way, I will completely admit that we also made it so technical and so complicated and there's efficacy and there's antibodies and people need to have hope because we do have hope. We've got vaccines that work. We've got treatments that work. We even have a way to take care of people Dr. that Patel, are unvaccinated. We don't land even in the have strict guidance on which masks are okay and which ones aren't. People walk around here with a little piece of cloth on there that they got from Kmart. It's completely worthless and everybody knows it. All of it's arbitrary and it's not worth anything. They need to start over somehow. Do they need some new faces? <laughs> well, I mean it, it is a year into the administration. No, I'm, I'm, I'm not laughing because it's funny. We always see a cycle a year into an administration. People leave and people come, and it's a good time to relieve some of the crew that's there because, frankly, <laughs> to your point, messaging has been delayed. But here's, here's the message. I think every American right now, no matter where you are, is just trying to think, what do I do? Who do I yep. listen to? Stay local. If you've got a high vaccination rate in your community, you can Keep that mask off and be safe as long as you also remember there are times where you're going to need to put it back in. Kids in masks, I think, Shep, are still a different story. Yep. We are just 10 days away probably from getting a vaccine for under five. And then we can have that protection that so many yeah, parents are looking I know for. A lot of parents so I will think love that's, that. that's what we're that's what we're balancing right now. We're not talking months and months. We're talking just a couple more weeks, which is a. Uh, I like the idea of March being a, a kind of a, a, a goal post, but we have some days to get there. March is better than February. I'm excited for May and June. Dr. Patel, it's great to see you. Thank yeah. you. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.